Hello, my beautiful badges and Messi Coda back again with another asset store review. This time it is the beautiful realistic wolf from Malbert Animations over on the Unity Asset Store. Now you get over 97 different animations with this bag. You get different wolf textures to play about with, and you also get the blend shapes to be able to change how your wolfie looks. And it's over on the Unity in the cell at the moment, but do not worry because also. You can pick this up on the Unreal Marketplace along with a load of other amazing Malvus packs as well. But we've got Unity, so we're going to be playing with that. So sit back and join. I'll see you all in a second. The realistic wolf pack from Malvus Animation. It's beautiful. You get with it also the poly ones as well. So you don't just get the realistic ones in this pack if you're wondering about the price. And you also get the URP, HDRP, and built in. There's 97, more than 97 animations. Winky face. I'm not sure what the winky face means. Is that? <laughs> it's, uh, 97 animations, or are there? I'm pretty sure there are 97 animations. And inside Unity, you, you get, as always, uh, the standard demo scenes that you get with the wolf. But you also, if you look here, demo and realistic for the base one. And so if I go here to the demo, you've got here your standard poly wolf. So if you are looking for poly wolves, yeah, you're looking gone. Beautiful poly wolves. Hello, poly wolf. Hello. But also over here, we've got the realistic one as well. And you get different. Let's go. Let's go big. You get different looking wolf textures on these now i've got to say that um i haven't actually come across a wolf in real life i have to be honest full transparency i've not i've seen alaskan malamutes i've seen huskies and i think uh, a malamute is like the closest we get a domesticated wolf aren't they that's what they use in the movies they use a malamute um, or malamute cross in the movies but um, I, I would say these look very wolf-like. I've seen pictures of wolves and I've seen wolves in movies. Now you actually even see wolves in movies, and it looks pretty much like a wolf. They're, the fact they've had, he's had some improvements. At first, when he came out, they they looked a little bit. Um, I'm going to say, uh, toony on the face, and now they're looking even better. Um, hello, Wolfie. He's got lovely teeth. All the better to um, eat you with. Then <laughs> we got to go straight into that one. I love the little cubs, the cute little cubs, big heads, smaller bodies, beautiful little things that these are. Okay, let's have a look at our Wolfie. Do we have a load of blend shapes on our Wolfie? Let's go and have a look. So, Wolfie! We're going to the Lods. We've got Lods on the Wolf, so that's good. Uh, blend shapes, we do. We've got blend shapes on our Wolfie. Well, that's good to know. We've got nose in, well, obviously, like with the elephants, you could, there are limits when you start mucking about too much. Yeah, look at that. Oh, my word. So we've got a lens shape in the teeth as well. Mouth, lens shape, nose in. Get the mouth in. You're good to hook these together. And then get the nose in. There we go. Oh, well, that's nice. Uh, neck fat. Oh, as again, as you say, like you gotta, you gotta do the fur. You gotta do them all together. Has he got a script to handle all that? I don't know. I don't know if he has. Maybe yeah. We could, we could easily do that. You know, what you gotta do is you gotta list all of these things here. Uh, find in the shader. The uh, when the skin rest render the, the these blend shapes uh, and then set them with a slider. It's actually something that I'm having to put into the late next version of Muck to support blend shapes. At the moment, Muck out of the box doesn't support uh, blend shapes, so I gotta add that in. Gotta add that in. Make his belly fat. Big fat belly. Big fat belly. Uh, legs i think that my legs just went there oh wow he's got a weight problem really got a weight problem this wolf look at that big fat tail looks like a fox if we go uh, and 
fur. Let's make it like the fur all furry and fat. So you could have really fat fur, but the body thin. Let's try that. So his body, he's got fur is on the max, but then everything else we got in. How does that look? Looks really weird. Okay, don't do that at home. <laughs> don't make don't make him really furry but then his body not so fat well you could just do the legs you know what <laughs> let's do let's do the legs okay uh, let's tell legs there we go so body's really thick but he's not fat he's just got long fur um so there you go that, actually that's not too bad that is not too bad that is not too bad at all I'm, I'm impressed with that it's got this uh you know the cards for his textures and, and i'm going to say the textures for the fur um looks all right it's obviously not like a a proper standalone fur system i've seen some people using that now with these wolves already to make it even better more realistic um but you know like little babies baby's got big thick, thick bushy tails haven't they wow okay so we've got blend shapes on our walls which is very important it's good to know fantastic okay let's pop in because as always you get if you've got the animal controller which is a separate asset and if you've got horse animal set pro he gives you a load of demo scenes now and we're going to save that because I've butchered it. We're going to jump into the rideable one because we're going to do a Game of Thrones style direwolf situation. That's what we're doing now. So let's go. Uh, why is it not full screen? Okay, let's do F10. There we go. And I can get on my direwolf. I'm on my direwolf. Like right, little hobo. Ride my wolf. It'd be good if we had a saddle. Always, it's the full animations which are the one weakness. Always, I find with uh, the Malibu stuff. So, it's this, this one. We plop. I always feel like it. You know, it, it's guiding. It could. Be, it, should, it needs to have like flaying legs. Like oh, I'm falling. Because after a certain point, if it's a if it's a small fall like this, then that's fine. But if it's a big fall, then there needs to be like you know it, it's been falling for more than X seconds and then kick into another animation of him going ah oh, legs akimbo I'm falling to my doom that kind of thing. So he's still got all the the speed ups and stuff level one speed, level two speed, and all that kind of stuff. I can't seem to be doing any kicks and things okay how do i do that no left click right click there's no attacks maybe i'm just wrong but i can't seem to pull out any attacks on the wolf it's odd like the dragons have got attacks when you're riding them oh. still waiting for them to make the badges still waiting for the badges to come in hopefully they'll come soon Okay, this is odd. Hmm. No attacks on the wolf. I can't find any attacks on the wolf. Let's get out of full screen mode. Let's go over to the animal controller demo scene. The playground. Now you've got point and click. You've got these callback examples. The AI with a sample brain thing. Uh, the mobile version. Look, with the clicky mobile controls. Thank you, Malbers. And as always with Malba's Playgrounds, you get this nice little area for you to test out the controller and say, no, I don't want to do that. No. Or you can say, yes, I do want to do that. Do you want to have some breakfast? Yes, I do. Okay. Speak. Puff. Puff. Okay. Ooh, have you done a poo? Then cover that up. Come up, you poo-poo. That's it. Lie. Did you eat the cookies? Oh, no. It's it's lying down. It's not tell a lie. Okay. How about have a seat? <laughs> I 
<laughs> oh, it's beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. Have a bit of a run. You can see the stamina going down. And pick up your ball. Lovely. And drop your ball. Alrighty then. So this is our this is our little wolfie wolfie over here. There's lots of fun things to play about with, as always, with these. So we can go for a little bit of a walk. Um, oh look, we've got the the crawl space. Oh, he's knackered. He's not. He's not knackered. He's just stopped and decided to take a seat. Let's go for level two running around. And back to level one. Let's go in the crawl space. Crawl, crawl with the ball in your mouth. Oh, he can't crawl with the ball in his mouth. I love that as he gets up and his head comes up. Oh, beautiful. Lovely stuff. Can he jump all the way up there? No, he can't. No, he can't. Normally, this is 10 cents shy of 60 bucks, but you can get it on a half price sale over on the Unity Asset Store for 29.9, 29 something. 29.50, I think about that. So if you are needing wolves or big dogs, then yes. Yes. Do I recommend this pack? Yes, I do. You get the low poly stuff as well as getting the realistic. And if you've got the animal controller or horse and insect pros, you see, you can get the animal controller like this to work. Or horse and insect pro, you can jump on him and take him for a ride. Now, you get other things in this pack as well. So let's have a look at, oh, scratching it behind his ear. <laughs> love these little animations they make just makes him feel alive just makes him feel alive so in this demo so we get some other textures out of these wolves ready made and there's also a little baby to play about with as well turning on all the little wolves so we can see here just like we saw in the other oh. <laughs> and all having a little animation fest beautiful beautiful little creatures they are done a great job i have to say it's done a great job nice variation even the the fur even the fur is good obviously if you had a proper fur kit to, or hair shader then this would look a lot better but i think out of the box it does look beautiful and it's also available on the unreal marketplace but it's currently on sale over on unity and to be honest i haven't played about on the unreal one to see how the animation uh, animal controller if that's all on there as well that's what I love about Malware stuff on Unity is that you get the animal controller, uh, you get the horse handling set pro, so you can ride your wolfie as well as just a beautiful wolfie with his animations that you can use. Uh, this one, wow, that's freaky. That's a freaky one, isn't it? Oh, because you know he does this with the low polys, and he's now done a realistic furry one like that. Oh my word! Oh my word! I want to be the baby wolf. I want to be the baby. Okay, I'm going to hide them all apart from the baby. Baby wolf. Kids will go wild for this. Let's see. Is it going to work straight away? Baby wolf. Baby. Oh. Oh my word. Can baby wolf attack? Baby wolf attack. And baby wolf barks like a mummy wolf. I need to have a little. Okay. Mowers, you need to have a little baby yap 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 noise. Okay, let's let's find the bark because he really that was that was not that was not a baby wolf barking. There's the bark. Okay, let's have a look. Don't sit down. Why are you sitting down? I never told you to sit down. Just like a child does whatever he wants. <laughs> No, that's not your voice. That's your, <laughs> that's your mum's voice. Oh my word. That's crazy. Oh. Do you need wolves? Yes. Do you need baby wolves? Yes. Do you need low poly? He's done it again. He just sat down. You just sat down. Is it like a random thing that when he's walked for so much, he will just sit down because he's, he's a child and he's tired? I don't know. I've got to say, beautiful little things though. He's done it again. What? 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 Stamina hasn't run out. Oh, so beautiful. His little beautiful blue eyes. Beautiful. Beautiful. Loving it. Really do. God, look at that. 
crazy crazy let's have a quick look, quick look at the low poly stuff so you get in the pack the realistic and the low poly two packs for the price of one you could say you've done that before like with the realistic elephants he's got the low poly elephants in there as well so i do i've said this last time that the names maybe need to be changed so that's is it oh, pick okay can't you can't fall with the ball in his mouth but then that's the, the focus of the pack is the realistic the focus of the pack is the realistic stuff but it's nice that you get the low polys because if you haven't already got the forest pack and you want to do low poly wolves well now you can and then you, if you've got a different project where you need realistic wolves then you're sorted and you get the same mix of different uh, textures in the low poly like you have in the realistic as well so that's cool we it's currently on sale get it while you can these wolves would go really great with uh, polytype studios low poly stuff uh, and they've got a load of fantasy things so i think these will be a perfect perfect low poly addition to the po polytope studio assets as well and there's a load of low poly stuff out there now i'm going to do a low poly face off soon which is a little bit different a little bit different some exciting stuff that you're gonna you're gonna enjoy we can even include malvers in that because he does quite a lot of low poly stuff now so if you do like these videos don't forget to go over click that big red subscribe button click like put a comment down below it really does mean a lot those comments and their likes help us they do they do help us howley they do oh wow if you do like it click it till next time if you want to see more of my crazy videos click on the left side of your screen now and down below there's that big juicy subscribe button and right next to it is the magic bell that if you click it it will tell you if i've got a new video coming out till next time